Hello everybody. Today we are going to talk about how to set up the tabs on the side of your business page. So this is for your business page and I want to show you exactly how you can set these tabs up. So first you're going to go to woobox.com and you're going to sign in. You're going to log in using Facebook. And this is a free site, everybody. Free, free, free. Okay, so what I want you to do is go to Static Tabs. And then you're going to click on Create a New Tab. Now, you can link your Pinterest, your Twitter, your Instagram, and your YouTube automatically. Um, so you type in the stuff and you're going to see these right here, okay? So when you go to those static tabs, you click on, say, Pinterest. We're going to set up our Pinterest. Um, you would type in the username for your Pinterest and then it's going to link it to you. Um, just hit save settings and then go to tab settings and um, you can click on whatever it is um, you want it to say right there and hit save and then you can go back and test your button and if they click on follow me on Pinterest it actually links up and shows them your Pinterest account right here and they can actually follow you from right here they can click on any of your boards it'll take them to um, anything same with Instagram you're gonna do the same exact thing um, they can follow you um, they can see all of your Instagram posts so um, if you haven't followed me definitely come over here and follow me on all of mine but what I want to do is show you how to um, set up your personal tabs so different things that you would like to put in there so if you go over here and go to static tabs again and click uh, create a new tab you're gonna hit this hotmail fangate tab so you click this and um, we're going to say um, where else can we say that we want to add I already did our VIP group so let's do um, one second I just set up a new group directly social so here is the group you copy the URL at the top and you go over here and you're gonna click on URL okay click on URL paste that URL right there hit save settings click on redirect paste URL save settings now you want to go to tab settings and we're going to write directly social beliefs save setting and now when we go over here we're gonna hit the refresh button and you can see directly social elites right here so uh, how you edit those is click settings edit page and then you can drag and drop this anywhere that you want and then go back to your page and you can see that it's fixed it right there and now that links them directly to where you want to go so for your business purposes, um, what you're going to want to have as tabs, right? What do you want to have? So you can have um, a join your company, join your VIP group, which is your customer Facebook group, 
request a catalog, which um, you can actually link those to your um, to your actual website. So let's see if I can move this up. Okay, so let me show you something here. So if you go to WooBox and you go to your website, so I'm going to type in my website, and this is what it's going to whoops, show as a customer. Okay, so uh, when a customer comes to my site, this is what they're going to see. So I can click on Join Us, and here's all the information on Joining 31. Well, I can click this link and I can link that to Join 31 Gifts in WooBox. Got it? Um, I can do, of course, follow me on YouTube and all those things. Um, shop 31. So you can give them the shop button. Um, so if you click on um let's say accessories you can go up here and um click on anything that you wanted so you could you could say storage and utility and you could take this and copy that and make a woobox tab for it um you can do um Individual things like I have host a 31 fundraiser. This actually links to um, my blog on hosting a fundraiser. So you can also have some kind of outside source um, that you have information pulled to. So there's so many different things that you can do when it comes to your buttons on the side of your page. But you definitely want to make sure that um, you have things that are so easily done. Because like the Join um, 31 Gifts, if someone asked you and you were at the grocery store about joining 31, you could literally like go to your page, give them the link to your page and say click on Join 31 Gifts and it's going to show you all that information. Another really great thing that you can do is um, you can write notes. So on your Facebook page you can actually write a note, <clears throat> host a 31 fundraiser, okay? Well at the top you can get this URL and you can link them in WooBox on that tab right to your own note on your own page. So actually, Join 31 Gifts, I can link that Join 31 Gifts tab right there right to this with all of my information for someone to enroll. Um, and you can actually tag people um, on your note. So um, it makes it so easy. If somebody asks you about something, you can have these notes ready and you can actually link these tabs right to the notes. So anyways, that is how you can really um, boost your page effectiveness and make it something um, where every time they click on something, it's leading them to you and pertinent information. Um, definitely the customer special um, also um, that's how if you go on this and you click special and you click customer special on your website like a customer is looking at it they will always be guided to the exact customer special if you use this link right here so this changes monthly but this link never changes. So having that tab on your um, your Facebook business page is going to allow you um, to always lead them to the current customer special. So it's pretty cool. So uh, if you can think of anything, uh, let me know. Don't forget to follow my YouTube channel for more tips and tricks just like this.